I'm Pharmacist Ben, and it's time for another moment of truth. Of all the vitamins, minerals, aminos, and fatty acids called the Mighty 90 Essential Nutrients, none is more confusing than the family of biomolecules collectively known as vitamin E. Unlike most other nutrients, vitamin E does not really participate in biochemical reactions. It's more like a group of molecules that fight what are called free radicals, oxidizing or rusting agents that interfere with the actions of fats, especially those in cell membranes. This protective role of vitamin E is important for defending the body from toxic chemicals, byproducts of normal metabolism, and UV solar radiation. And given the environment we live in, this makes daily use of the nutrient a vital part of maintaining good health. Vitamin E is especially important for the cardiovascular system. And in fact, the original research on this important nutrient was done on the heart. It's also critical for brain health and can help protect against cognitive decline associated with aging. And vitamin E has wound healing properties and can help keep the skin from burning when it's exposed to the sun. Wheat germ oil, nuts, fish, and avocados are the best food sources of vitamin E, but don't contain a lot of it. So to get the maximum benefits from this critical nutrient, supplementation is a must. Vitamin E comes in two classes called tocopherols and tocotrienols, each made up of four subfractions, making eight types of vitamin E in total. Look for formulas called mixed tocopherols and mixed tocotrienols. Try to use a dose of 200 to 400 IU every day. And vitamin E is best taken with fatty foods. That's today's moment of truth. Have a beautiful day. We'll talk to y'all later. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.